Good morning from Lebanon. Look how beautiful this is. Hiking all the way down there to there. So it is day one in Lebanon, and I am here with baby. <laughs> it's so beautiful here. Like it, it honestly like takes your breath away. Like I think I've almost cried a few times. And we are starting our hike. It's um spring right now here in Lebanon so all the cherry blossoms are blooming and they look so beautiful there's so so many of them maybe we can get a photo with them at some point oh she's so cute <laughs> Sailing down from up there. We made it down to the waterfall. This is one of the seven wonders of the world, and I can see why it is stunning. It's amazing and terrifying at the same time. The rocks are super slippery and we were just spending about an hour taking photos around this location and I'll insert some photos here so you can see. Um, but yeah, this place is beautiful. I didn't realize that they were right behind me. <laughs> and thank you so much for your help. He's been like making sure we don't fall over and helping us hold our cameras and stuff. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we were so lucky to have this to ourselves for like half an hour. Look at all the people now. There was like two people while we were taking photos. I'll get more later. We're gonna walk all along here now, which is a, it's like a natural rock bridge. took some pictures up here in this area and now we're gonna shoot some up here and we're standing on the natural bridge it's pretty terrifying it is amazing I am like freezing cold though my fingers feel like ice cubes Ooh, and my nose is really running I didn't realize it was gonna be so cold here um, but we're super high up in the mountain and there's still actually snow in the in the mountain so that's why it's super cold but I think we're going to take a few more photos and then head off to another location and from this lookout you can see the very bottom of the waterfall that's where the waterfall ends just there and there's the three caves. Oh, this place is <laughs> insane. I can't believe this is real. All right, gotta start the climb back up. Yikes. <laughs> I'm 
Oh, my dog uh, is enjoying a day on the beach. Oh, can I meet him? Bring him. <laughs> Just going for a walk now around this suburb and we're gonna get something to eat. We are walking down this beautiful like closed off road where there are a bunch of different restaurants and shops and pubs and stuff like that. It's so pretty. Biblos and we're looking at the museum that's indoors and just walking around the grounds of this amusing castle. What do you think of it? Holy land. I think our first photo spot is going to be up here in the rocks with the beautiful buildings and mountains in the background. Here. Right, we are at the top. We made it to the top. It's like a 360 degree view of Lebanon, of Junia and Beirut all the way down there. This is this is amazing. I'm so, so happy right now. I can't even, I didn't even know what to say. I'm just so happy. That's an interesting way to um, serve someone a beer. Uh, guys. What is that? This is the thing that's hot. That's hot. Oh, the thing that tastes like licorice. Give it a try. Cheers. <laughs> the plate of food that we ordered is just hanging up uh, from a hook in the ceiling. We, uh, we tried to catch sunset, but we missed it by like five minutes. It set over the horizon already. Um, but we still took a few like post-sunset silhouette photos where um, like the sky was still orange, but it wasn't, the sun wasn't there. But I think they look pretty cool. Oh, I'm puffed out because we like ran all the way down the street. We're like going crazy taking photos and now they're going all the way back up. Oh, I think KB is coming. Hello. Hey, kitty. Oh. I didn't get to show you guys, but this is the hotel we're staying at here in Lebanon, in Junia. Juni. I don't know how to pronounce it. Junia. Junia. Oh, yeah, she doesn't know either. <laughs> we both did both the pronunciations. Monte Casino. So I've had like my favorite pair of jeans for like the longest time and um, it got to a point, I think I had them for like three years and I used to wear them all the time, but it got to the point where they were like super faded and um, before I came to Dubai, I went to the shops and I actually found the same pair of pants. Dan pointed out to me actually and um, I bought them and I'm loving 
These are so jet black. It's totally missing that with my old pair of jeans. Ooh. Right, we are gonna go out now. Hey, we have met up with our friends again. Say hi, you guys. Hi. 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 And he just went inside. But we are gonna head out. Hooligan. We are at a cocktail cafe, but the cocktails they make are actually out of fruit here. And look at this! It's humongous! And you got one! And you got one! <laughs> and you got a, like a fruit platter, which looks really good. And. KB got her daily avocado and another one. <laughs> so we're just making one final stop after dessert. And then we're going to head back. <laughs> so wish for something, wish for someone to get well. Just any wish. just enjoying the work. We just climbed up to the top of the Virgin Mary statue, which was like a little tower with a staircase spiraling around it. And the view up here looks incredible. Just trying to be a bit quiet because there's a lot of people praying right now. Alright, I'm gonna head back down now. We just got back to our hotel after having our first full day in Lebanon. And can I just say that this place is so beautiful. I had my doubts traveling here when I was back at home in Australia. Not because of, like I, I've always wanted to come to Lebanon, like I know it's a beautiful country, but um, it's a do not travel zone for Australia and America. Just even after being here for one day and having Fada and her boyfriend and their best friend, you know, show us around and tell us like about their life and like, you know, them bringing into us into their lives and taking us to all the beautiful places and to their favorite restaurants and everything. I'm just, I'm just so happy right now. I'm like, yeah, it's late again. I'm running off like five hours sleep, which isn't much for me. <laughs> I'm feeling tired, but I'm happy. So all is well in life. But um, yeah, I'm gonna take a shower now and go to sleep because we're gonna do it all over again tomorrow. All right, well, I'm exhausted, but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys all next time.